الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على أشرف الأنبياء والمرسلين سيدنا مولانا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين أما بعد عن أبي هريرة رضي الله تعالى عنه قال قال رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم يأتي الشيطان أحدكم فيقول من خلق كذا من خلق كذا حتى يقول من خلق ربك فإذا بلغه فليستعذ بالله ولينته أو كما قال النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم رواه البخاري قال خاتي آف أبو هريرة May God be pleased with him, he said. The Holy Messenger of Allah, may peace and mercy of Allah be upon him, he said. Satan comes to one of you and says to him, Who has created this and who has created that? Till he says to him, Who has created your Lord? And when this whisper touches you, You should seek refuge in Allah Almighty and give up these thoughts. Respected viewers, this hadith reveals that Satan Iblis cast us loud to one of a man, saying to him, Who has created your Lord? So that he may make him doubtful about the existence of Allah Almighty and mislead to him and so that a faithful believer may not worship Allah Almighty by such location. So the Holy Prophet peace upon him said that when this whisper touches you, you should seek refuge in Allah Almighty and give up these thoughts. As regards that, who has created Allah Almighty? So, actually, this question is illogical because Allah is the one who is uncreated and none has created Him. The Holy Quran reveals, A'udhu Billahi Minash Shaitan Rajeem, Bismillah Rahman Rahim. قُلْ هُوَ اللَّهُ أَحَدُ اللَّهُ سَمَدُ لَمْ يَلِدْ وَلَمْ يُولَدْ وَلَمْ يَقُلْ لَهُ كُفُوًا أَحَدُ Say He is Allah, the one, Allah, the eternally resort of all. He begat us not, nor was begotten, and there is none comparable unto Him. He was in the ways that Allah, is the one who is uncomparable and there is no one else like to him. As regards that, how can one recognize Allah Almighty? So he should consider the signs, which means the signs into man's soul and the horizontal signs as regards the signs into man's soul. So the Holy Prophet peace upon him said that Man ala khanassahu faqad ala kharabbahu Whoever recognized himself so he will recognize Allah Almighty. It means man should think about his reality that where he come from and that was his first stage. So he was a thick and fluid in the womb of mother. And then Allah Almighty fashioned him a complete baby. Then his mother gave birth in this world. And by and by he becomes a young man. And after, after that, he becomes an old, and then he dies. This is the reality of man. 
and the horizontal signs in the universe are that man should consider the sun, the moon, the stars, the planets, the galaxies and they are billions or billions but more. But they do not collide to each other and they move into a fixed circle because Allah Almighty runs the universe. And if man is sincere to find the Allah Almighty, then he should strive for it. As the Holy Quran reveals, وَالَّذِينَ جَاهُوا فِينَا أَنَادِيَنَّا سُبُرَنَا As for those who strive for us, so we show our part. It means the man, if he strives sincerely, he wants to find the Almighty, to meet the Almighty, to love the Almighty, then he should sincerely strive for him. So the Almighty will show him the path coming towards him. And second is that if the man is sincere, so he should surrender himself before Allah Almighty and act upon all his commandments according to the good example of the Holy Prophet, peace be upon him, so that he may be successful in this world and also in the hereafter. May Allah Almighty he was to to act upon this. Amin, Pamalina, Vidal Bravo, Vidal.